Glory to Jesus Christ. Today is Sunday, April 21st, the 35th day of the fast, and we remember on this day is St. Mary of Egypt. We continue our catechesis from St. Nikolai of Zicha on the Ten Commandments, and now we're on the Eighth Commandment. What are we forbidden by the Eighth Commandment of God? We are forbidden to steal. The person who steals is called a thief. We are forbidden to be thieves. What is called stealing? Taking secretly some property belonging to one's neighbor or community, engaging in open robbery by violence of someone else's property, cheating the poor and ignorant in buying or selling, shirking one's duty in public offices and working less than required, and living by means of frauds, trickeries, and falsifications. What does God expect us to do in a positive way as to this commandment? God expects us to respect everyone's property, to be honest and upright in all our dealings with men, to live from our own, our, from our own work, to help our less fortunate neighbors, to be faithful and diligent in public offices, and to do even more than we are expected to do. And then we'll read some text from the Triodion for the fifth Sunday of the fast. Again, this is the Sunday of St. Mary of Egypt. In thee, O mother, was preserved unimpaired that which is according to God's image. For thou hast taken up the cross and followed Christ. By thine actions thou hast taught us to despise the flesh, for it passes away, but to care for the soul, which is a thing immortal. And so thy spirit, Holy Mary, rejoices with the angels. All the rebellious impulses of the flesh thou hast subdued by thine ascetic labors, showing the manly courage of thy soul. Desiring to behold the cross of the Lord, O honored mother, in sanctity thou hast crucified thyself unto the world, and thou hast sought with eagerness to emulate the angels in their way of life. Therefore, with faith we honor thy memory, O blessed Mary, and we pray that full remission of our sins may be given to us through thine intercessions. In our hymns we praise thee now, all venerated Mary, as the Lamb and daughter of Christ. Sprung from the stock of the Egyptians, thou hast fled from all their errors and was offered as a precious flower to the church. In abstinence and prayer, thou hast struggled above the measure of man's nature, and so thou wast exalted by Christ. For through thy life and actions, Mary all revered, thou wast made a bride of the heavenly kingdom. And these are some texts from the fifth Sunday of the fast. Glory to Jesus Christ.